morning guys um so this uh this field in front of me right here is where we had our our silage heap um because we we usually plant maize every year and then we harvest and we make a big silage heap in this pasture and with this little field and um this year we decided not to plant maize so we i don't have a silage heap this year so what i did is i planted teff here for the calves um, you can see here we planted this teff and i'm basically going to put calves calves near these calves here that you see here in front of me um, this field here next to, next 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 to us this one right in front of me this was a this is basically a cow lot or pen a dirt cow yard where we store the cows in winter time i did a video we put wood chips down on that side there and you can see that 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 half is still got the wood peelings or bark or whatever you want to call it wood bark i think is what it actually is that side and then this piece this piece that was dirt once the cows had finished carving i also planted teff this side and i've had the, ca the calves here for a bit you can see they've been eating it but now it's got to the point where it's finished so i want to move them over to this side but um, I've also got my bale stack there in the corner. Sorry for the wind, it's quite windy. So I've got my bale stack there in the corner, and I'm um, I'm gonna basically build a fence across there so that the calves don't get into my bales and eat and bite holes in the plastic. So that's what I'm gonna do now, quick. And I just wanted to show you guys how we how we put our poles. Um, we use a, a pole driver to put our poles in. I bought it quite recently, it's quite a new piece of equipment because um, we had to re fence the whole farm. Uh, the fence were, fences were very, in a very bad state, and uh, since our fences are all electrical, um, when they start to get to a bad state, you, you have a lot of shorts and, and you, you know you have problems with electricity not flowing everywhere and you have cows breaking out and getting into places where they really shouldn't be so um, I just want to show you guys that so we're just going to put in some poles quick yeah so this is where I'm going to store my bales and now we need to build a fence across so the calves don't bite holes in the in the bales so basically we're going to hammer this pole in it's a nice and long pole so it won't come off okay uh daily leave it up yes first put on your feet for support Идем!
Dat zijn diepe en. Een meer stokje. Ground is very soft, but if it's a if it's hard ground, what you do is you 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 cut the pole's tip like a pencil, so it can go in easy. These are old poles that we're using again, but if that's what you do if the ground's hard. But this is very soft ground, so it's not necessary. Okay. Yes, it's a draadspan. Yes, it's a draadspan. 